What's up, Chunky Bunch? Today I'm with Taylor and Pre. Wow. What's up, Chunky Bunch? Today I'm with Taylor. Hi, and me. And Preston. And we have a package from my friend from the MTM DM channel in Canada. This is Canadian Snacks Part 2. Americans try Canadian Snacks, right? Yeah. 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 What's up, y'all? Welcome back to another episode of the Thick and Chunky Show. I'm your host, Mr. Corey Styles. With me today is Taylor. Hi. And Preston. Yeah. <laughs> Today we are Americans trying Canadian snacks. Snacks. Today we are Americans trying Canadian snacks part two. My friend MTM over at the MTM DM channel sent us this box of snacks. We're gonna go ahead and let him introduce himself. This is what inside the Mr. Corey style studio looks like. It looks just like my kitchen. Really, serious. What? We're on right now? Oh, hey, how's it going? It's MTM from the MTM DM channel. Super excited to be here on the Thick and Chunky show. It's gonna be awesome. I got some gifts for Corey. He's gonna review them, he's gonna try them, and he's gonna talk about them because, well, I'm not a food review guy. I've tried and, well, I'm gonna leave this one up to the experts. Cool, I'm excited to see what's in here. It came with a jump drive and a letter. That's awesome, man. Are you guys excited to get into this? No! Alright. Packaging. Don't. Packaging. Yeah. We don't care Packaging. About First thing that we are going to try is the Cuban lunch. Actually, I'm going to move this to the side over here. It sounds Chocolate good. bar with peanuts. It I don't really like peanuts. So I think you do. Let's go ahead and let MTM explain it to us. Bam, there it is. Mr. Corey Styles is getting his very own Cuban lunch. Now I did a review of this on my own. Well, tried, as this is why I'm sending this particular item to Mr. Corey Styles to do it right. Don't let me down, Corey. I know you won't. But if you want to see my review of this product and a little more information behind it, the link will be in the description. All right, but this is truly a Canadian product. Watch my video, you'll find out why. Tell me what you think, Corey. Yeah. It sounds delicious. Let's open it up. Canadian delicacy. Whoa. I'm gonna take the nuts out of mine. You can't take the nuts out, just take a little bite. Mmm. Like it. Cheers. Whoa, that's good. Yeah, I actually like that. I thought I wasn't going to like that. Oh, well, I did like it. The chocolate almost has like a coffee flavor to it, huh? You taste that? What do you think? Mm. I like this. I think this is bun. I'm gonna give this a A plus. Are you? A plus from the little one. What do you think? An A. An A? I think it's an A plus two. It is stout. These bars are like super thick chocolate. The chocolate's good and the nuts, it's all combined into one. Lots of peanuts in it too. This is delicious. I like peanuts and chocolate. No. Peanuts and chocolate. All right, MTM, what do you got next for us? Oh, these, I got you these two. You're, we don't need to talk about them because you're an honorary Canadian. Guys. I hate to tell you about this one, those cheesies did not make it. They made it here, but they didn't last long enough for the video. It was his fault. It was my fault. Those things are my, those are my vice. I love those things so much. They were amazing again. All right, let's try again. What else you got? VI hot sauce. Is that what it's called? Just Vancouver Island hot sauce. Now, just the name in itself screams Canadian. Vancouver Island, that's where I live. Well, Corey was nice enough to build this set to look like I'm on Vancouver Island. A little homesick right now. Vancouver Island hot sauce. Now, hot sauce itself isn't Canadian, obviously, but this is a local company. This is my definite go-to hot sauce. Vancouver Island, Salsa Verde. Boom! Yeah, Vancouver Island hot sauce. Small batch artisanal hot sauce. No one got drink of that. Breath of Habanero. 
I'm not trying that. No? Oh. No. I'm Taylor, gonna... are you going to try it? A little dab. A little dab. All right. I'm going to let you dab in the dab. Okay? And then mine. I'm just going to cover the whole thing in it. Don't let it touch, bye. No, you got it. Cheers. That's hot, hot sauce. Dad really likes hot sauce. Mm, that's like good hot sauce. Dad really likes hot sauce and... and I tried hot sauce, but I didn't cry, YouTube. That's right. Uh, Preston tried Tapatio. This is really good. I prefer the hot sauces that aren't super vinegary, and that's like this is. It's a green hot sauce, so it has a lot of the actual vegetable in it. I really like that. I want you to give it an A+. I bet you will give it I think that. it's up there. I'm not going to give it a grade necessarily, but I definitely like it and I'm going to eat the entire bottle, me and my wife. Refrigerate after opening, so I'm gonna try to eat it fast because one of my things with hot sauces is I don't like refrigerated hot sauce that much. It's like cold hot sauce. Yeah, cold hot sauce is kind of backwards, but I am gonna try this. Did you like it? Mm -hmm. Yeah? I don't know. Dad, whenever something's like against me, I start, my leg starts getting sweaty, so it does. So my leg is getting sweaty from your leg. It's kind of like, whoa. All right, last but not least is syrup. Now, I said multiple times I wanted to try real Canadian maple syrup because I've had syrup, but I'm told that Canadian maple syrup is way better. Now, I'm gonna go ahead and let MTM explain this one to you because I do not know the difference. Okay, so this one in particular is one I've been looking forward to Corey doing. I can't remember if he was in one of his live chats. You gotta check out his live chats, they're fun. It's kinda like you're just sorta of hanging out, asking questions and chilling with him and his wife. It's good times, you gotta, you gotta do it if you haven't. But anyways, somewhere he had said that he wanted to try Canadian maple syrup. Like legit Canadian maple syrup. So guess what? Bam, I got this one here. Now this one here, is one of the ones that you could pick up down at the touristy shops. Um, you know, cruise ship terminals, airports, things along that line. I got this one down at uh, Gastown in Vancouver where I work in that area. Bought it on company time. <laughs> This one's totally legit. Like this one I got at one of those high-end grocery stores, like a Whole Foods type situation, but it's not, it's our hack Canadian version or something. But this one here has got to be legit. It's got French on it, it's in a can, and uh, it's made right here in product of Canada, and Canada's second because, well, we won't go there. And uh, it's made right in Quebec, so very dark, strong taste it says on it. Probably written in French too. Just translated. All right, Corey, do me proud and let me know. But the funny, here's a funny side story. This one here was, it was pricey, but this one here, dollars for donuts for the amount you get to the price, this one's more expensive. Touristy stuff. All right, let me know. Well, I'm watching. I'm excited. I really wanted to try this syrup. We do need something to try it with. What should we try it with? <laughs> Waffle. A waffle? Because okay. we ate chicken. There's only one way I know how to make waffle appear, and that is for you to clap your hands. Just like that. Now, these waffles are Spider-Man berry waffles, but... Mom got them for me. <laughs> that's all we had at the house. But we're going to try Turkey Hill maple syrup first, if I could get it open. No, I'm not trying that either. You're not trying... It's syrup, dude. I don't think it's going to taste like... Syrup. This is the best kind of syrup. This is Canadian syrup. I want you little to syrup. try it and then I will try it. A little sip. You don't do a sip, you do a down. That's good. Mm. Whoa. Mm. That's good, right? <laughs> that's that's super tasty, huh? You like it? Yeah. That's good. That it's very laugh. sweet. It made me laugh because I thought it was bad. Did you like that? Mm -hmm. What about you? 
Yeah. You liked it? Yeah. Good. I'm going to give Three it an A+. Plus. Plus. Already. That's probably my favorite. I need the can opener, please. So this one comes in a can. This is supposed to be like really legit. Now I'm sure someone from Canada is probably gonna get on and say that's not legit or something like that. I get a little bit of hate, but for the most part, the Canadian support that we got on the first video is the most amazing amount of support that we've ever seen on our channel. So awesome, right? Yeah, I, 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 I need to start filming a channel with me. Oh yeah? Yeah. Your own channel? Yeah, but first, I did the bean boozle. Oh, I'm not trying that. It's just syrup, Preston. Oh! And Preston. Why are these? The bean it's, is it just like another pair of that syrup? It's a, yeah, it's the same kind of syrup, right? Yeah. But it's uh, a little bit thinner, right? Let's give me a little dot. Make this. There you go, Tay. Thank you. Here, P. Give me this little Here. dot. Try it. Mmm. It's good. Give it a plus. <laughs> oh, that was a mess. It's All right. Good. That's probably the best syrup I've ever had. I taste the two syrups mixed together. Mmm. It's like the. Mmm. Brayden, come try this. It's maple with maple syrup and it tastes like a pancake. <laughs> it tastes like a waffle with maple syrup because that's what it is. All right. That's amazing. Real maple syrup from Canada is the best maple syrup of all time that I've ever had. No, if someone says, well, you never had maple syrup from here. Okay. I'm giving it an A plus. This is delicious. Even this was really good. This is, I'm gonna pour this in a container so we can keep it. If we have any friends who live in Africa, we've gotta have them get us maple syrup from Africa. Uh, do, you, do they have maple syrup from Africa? <laughs> I don't think so, man. Once again, the Canadian snacks are amazing. The cheesies are just as amazing this time as they were the first time. You guys have to take my word for it because I ate the entire bag. That chocolate and peanut bar was fantastic. The hot sauce is really good. And these two maple syrups, man, these, this is my favorite syrup I've ever had. Yeah, they blew the world. What? I think the world. I said wow. they blew the world with the taste. Oh, the taste was that good, huh? Yeah. All right, guys, that was Americans Try Canadian Snacks Part 2. MTM, you have anything else to add? All right, that's it for me. I'm MTM from the MTM DM channel. Could you imagine how cool it would be if I had a thick and chunky t-shirt to do these little skits with Corey? I mean, we're right here in the studio. Maybe I'll be able to wrangle one up. Not too sure, maybe rummage around when he's not looking. <laughs> All right, as always, thank you so much for checking out Corey's channel. I really appreciate being here. I'd like to thank Corey so much for allowing me to be on his channel. And uh, if you're not subscribed to Corey's channel, what are you doing? It's an awesome channel. He's over the 1,000 mark now, but let's keep him climbing. Let's keep him going and uh, let's keep sending him some Canadian food. All right, guys. Thanks a lot, and back over to you, Corey. Thanks, bro, I really appreciate it. Thank you to everybody who got us 10,000 views on the last Canadian Snacks. 10,000 views, that's crazy. Which was basically daughter, daddy time. Basically, that's what it was. But now it's daughter, dad, Preston time. <laughs> Once again, thank you for tuning into the Thick and Chunky Show. Please make sure you like this video with a up. Please make sure that if you're not already subscribed and you enjoy the content you consider describing. Describing or <laughs> subscribing? Subscribing. Subscribing. And if you really feel what we do, go ahead and share this joint on social media for, for everyone. Blah, blah. And if you really feel what I do, go ahead and share this joint on social media with anybody you see fit. For Taylor, Preston, and myself, thanks for coming. Peace.